Um, I'm not sure if it's a case of motivating. It's just making some good decisions. Uh, not everyone's tired. Um, it's ensuring that uh, concentrating for the full 20 minutes and, and chances will come if, if, if you plan the right areas and uh, uh, you know we have some quality going forward so having just taken that one chance uh, we had a couple um, but uh, ultimately you know we're fairly the camp's fairly happy with a point tonight okay and um, now Jeremy was stopping shots all over the place what do you have to say about his night uh, he was he was outstanding I thought it was very good um, it was good for him to have a, a a performance like that, especially at home, because he was disappointed with his performance against Siena, and that gets that out of the system. And it was nice for our team, especially second half tonight, to uh, to show our fans that we're a decent, decent soccer team that were better than our first performance. So, at half time, I was a bit concerned, but the, the, the boys really rallied and uh, played some good stuff as the, as the game uh, went on. Right. Okay. And um, and Jeremy said that. I just I noticed that there's a lot of time when he gets the ball before he kicks it or punts it. There's a lot of time, and is that like something that you encourage, or is he just reading the template? Um, yeah, it's the responsibility of the goalkeeper. He he has the his fingers on the pulse of the game. It sometimes needs to speed up the tempo, and other times, if we're absorbing a bit of pressure, it's to kind of slow slow the game down. So, you know, he's been doing this for a while, and. Uh, um, has a good feel for, for when is the time to, to hit that early ball or when you know the, the back four may need a little bit of a break and uh, take some time off the clock. Right. Um...